Louisville. How you say it can determine whether you're a native or a visitor. But me, I call it home. What is up guys? Welcome back to another episode of Xville. I'm Pac-Man. And Jessica. And we are here today at Wild Lights Lantern Festival at the Louisville Zoo. And they have a lot of like... Lantern sculptures. Lantern sculptures. Yeah. And it's a separate ticket event to get in. It cost how much? It was $15 for us as zoo members, but it's $18.50 for non-zoo members. And then you also have to pay $5 parking. So if you get if you're a zoo member, you do get a discount. Otherwise, it's $18 plus five for parking. And this is the first Saturday of this event. It's kind of cold. There's a lot of people here. A lot. There's a lot of cool lights, yeah. and the merry-go-round is open. It's open. So we may or may not ride it. We'll see. But we're going to go and see what kind of lights they've got. And when you walk in, they're going to make you go to the right, which is towards the islands in the Herp Aquarium, which is different from our usual path. We usually go left towards the lions, but that is the exit only. But there's a fish back here. We're going to check out this fish. He looks pretty cool. And most of the exhibits are closed right now, but we're here to see lights. They even made the swings glow for the kids. And there's some like walk pads here.
These are all the zodiacs. I am the year of the horse. I'm the rat. Well, this year's the year of the mouse, so you're good. I'm good. Now this is the one you've seen before. It used to be outside African Outposts for a while. There's a lot of people here today. A lot of people. There's flamingos here, but there's some real ones over there. You can't really see them because it's pretty dark back there. But maybe, there they are. We're gonna get some food. These are the options they have. Dragon Shack, which is, we already passed that. We are down here at Wild Burger. So they have crispy Thai chicken sandwich. Sesame ginger burger, cheeseburger spring rolls, wild tots. Probably gonna get the cheeseburger spring rolls and maybe the sesame ginger burger or the tot chicken. I don't know. Definitely the spring rolls. Yeah. Okay, so we did get cheeseburger egg rolls and then we got the sesame ginger burger and it came with a side of tots. And I'll let you know how it is. It's quite dark. So we're using a flashlight, in case you're wondering. Yeah. It's very dark. One thing I have like pepper jack cheese and like a slaw and then some sort of like yuzu sauce, but it's pretty good. You can try it. Yeah. I know. What do you think? Not too bad. Yeah. We've actually had a lot burger here. As you know, we always get chicken dinner. It's pretty damn good burger. Yeah. Do you want to try an egg roll? Or a spring roll? They're pretty, they look good. Should I dip it in ketchup? Um, i take a bite without the ketchup. Oh, <gasps> oh man, look at that scene. Oh my god. I'm very hot. Can you even taste anything? Nope. Oh, hot. <laughs> Look at it, yes. Look at that. Wow. Getting any flavor yet? Okay. You get these? Let it cool down. That Maybe. is really good. Ooh. Try some ketchup. Let's see. Maybe it'll cool down. Maybe a little. It's not really good. Ooh, I'm it's excited. Spicy it's spicy ketchup? Ooh, that's a nice surprise. Okay, Hot. sure. Hey, look. That's good. Spicy ketchup. Now, I don't know how it tastes at Disney World. I know Tim Tracker used to get 
cheeseburger egg rolls mm -hmm. next to the jungle craze. But when we went, they didn't have those. They they were not for sale at the time. So we didn't get the chance to try them, but these are really good. Now I understand why he loves them so much. Yeah, there's even like, I don't know if you can see, there's like onions and sauce and the, the meat in there. And the ketchup's kind of spicy. Yeah. A little kick to it. So if you don't like spice, then maybe don't it. dip it. But. but I would suggest getting this yes. over the burger if you come to this event. Because these burgers you can pretty much get any time in the season. Just not with the uh, ginger coleslaw. Yeah. That's what they're calling it. But we're going to finish this off, and then we're going to continue on. And in case you're wondering, these are the prices of everything we got. The sesame burger was $11. With our discount, it took $1.10 off the burger. And then the cheeseburger spring rolls were 5 bucks. And of course, we forgot to uh, bring our cup, so we had to pay full price for a drink. But it ended up being like $18.77. But yeah. <laughs> It's not too bad. So we came on the first day of all this and it is super packed. Well, the first Saturday. It's the first Saturday. I wish Saturday. we would have been there the first day because it was Thursday. Yeah, there's probably not that many people. Probably not. But the food was good. I actually enjoyed it. The uh, cheeseburger egg rolls, perfect. They were amazing. I do have one complaint, however, of the burger. It's not enough burger patty. This is just a minor complaint. It still tasted good. shack here next to the moons not the bananas and this is where they get the Chinese sugar donuts and you can get spring rolls and popcorn and soft pretzels and other stuff like that it's not very expensive though Those frogs are pretty great. Oh my god, they were amazing. I love the poses.
And of course, there's an elephant one next to the elephant enclosure. <laughs> Hi, Scotty. You can do a photo op right there to get some wings, but we're not gonna do it. So we did find this shirt in the gift shop. I think it's $26.99. So we're gonna get it. Okay guys, sorry we didn't talk very much through this. There was just a lot of people and it was super dark. And this was mostly for you to see the lights that were here. But we did have fun. There's yeah. a lot of people here today. Just too much for my comfort. So, you can maybe come on a weekday. I yeah. think they have it on like Thursday, Friday, to Saturday, Sunday yeah. until April 25th. Yeah, so avoid Saturdays coming to this. It is very crowded. Uh, but if you come, try those egg rolls. Those yeah. are delicious. Uh, there were also some like Chinese sugar donuts. We didn't try them, but they sounded pretty good. They had like cinnamon and five spice powder on them. But. Yeah, we was going to try a lot more food, but it was very crowded. and. It was hard to show you the food. I hope you guys got a good look at that. And we did as much as we could here today. It was pretty dark uh, and crowded. So, but I hope you guys. Yeah, it was a lot of fun. Yeah, lot of yeah. fun. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And as always, hit that subscribe button. Ring that bell if you guys want to be notified when we post new videos. Also, leave a comment down below. Let us know if you guys have come. Let us know if you guys have come to the Lantern Festival and if you guys enjoyed it. But until next time, kick it extra style. We love you guys. Pac-Man out. Next time, we are at Bush Gardens. It's terrifying, I'm telling you. Like <laughs> These two really, really, really love people. <laughs> but I'm pretty sure every dog loves peanut butter. This boy is very serious about his peanut butter. <laughs> peanut butter time, peanut butter time. Puppies love the peanut butter. Cause it's peanut butter time, <laughs> peanut butter time. Look at those tongues. <laughs> <laughs> Love it.